Oh, there. Oh, God, God darn it. I didn't mean to do that. But okay, here we go. Yeah. Oh, my head. Who turned out the lights? Oh, my brain. Oh, shut up. <laughs> How does he survive this? I mean, he gets... Look at what he's getting sucked into. I mean, his... I think his personal ship is just so overpowered compared to the rest of them that he always uses it last. And it's just, it's just that little ship that's holding him alive. Ridiculous. Uh oh, that's not good. This might not end well. No shit, Sonic. You know what? It's time to run. Go, 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 gotta get out of here. By the way, this game trolls you. If you stay in the middle right at the start, you die. Everyone always dies the first time. It's hilarious. So yeah, just keep running, pretty much. Run! Run, Sonic! You have to get away or else you're going to die! This one requires a heavy jump. And now you just run! Run! No! Dodge everything! Sonic, no! Dead. Thank you for watching Sonic Colors, where we save the day on an hourly basis. Stay tuned for Sonic Generations Dual Commentary, eventually. Ah, oh, two best Sonic games in years, and maybe we'll do Adventure 2 somewhere down the line, I'm not sure. I sure was fun though. I like how this ending is almost exactly the ending to Sonic, to uh, Mario Galaxy 1. Where all the little creatures of, made of energy by the way, which are both the same as Lumas, <laughs> somehow, basically, save him. It's the exact same ending. It's literally the exact same ending, and it's still... And it's like the best Sonic ever. Imagine that. Man, I can't believe you made it it's literally perfect, though. I mean, I don't, I don't even really care that Sega basically just copy the entire idea. It's fine. Galaxy's a hype thing to do these years, you know. Thanks, but I had a little help during that last part. That's okay. And yep, uh, all the frenzies got back to normal, yay! Okay, what's going on, guys? Derpity, derpity, derp. He said, thank you for saving us. No problem. You're welcome. Thank you for saving us. Uh, he says, you are welcome. That thing's translating pretty good. Yep, I finally got all the kinks out. We can talk to them perfectly now. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Have to leave. Bye. Bye. Oh, great. He says, goodbye, my friends. I have to go. Just when I got this thing working. <laughs> Better late than never, buddy. Yeah, I guess so. Bye. Right See you, bro. Top five. Huzzah! And, um, averting the fact that, um, all those planets would have killed everyone, they take them away. Thanks. We did it. Huzzah. And that grass is beautiful. <laughs> And here's the ending, which we won't record, by the way, because it is long as fuck. It will be an entire episode if I record this ending. It's a nice song, though. You should look it up. It's, um, I don't know. Just look up Sonic Colors ending. The song is really good, but I can't fucking record all this. It would take an eternity. All right, later. But wait, what happened to Eggman? Faster, put your backs into it. Technically, we don't have backside. Shut the hell up. Just push! We have to hurry! I have my revenge plotted. 
I know I'll use some kind of Time Lord thing, because I've never done that before. Not in an alternate timeline, for sure. Nothing. Nothing like that. <laughs> I like how they put Q-Bot just to annoy Eggman. Why would you invent a friend that annoys you? Yeah, silence is pretty maddening. I always like to have music in the background, otherwise I can't do something. It's very boring. Hmm. I do like the fireworks that were in the intro. That was really good. Derp, derp, derp. Oh god, kill me! Urgh. 